so 28.18 download and 20.11 upload. That's not too bad. Yep, dab YouTube. What's up, boys and girls? It's your boy Zockstar. Once again, coming at you with another vlog. And on this vlog, we are in Koron. That's right. We are in the beautiful Koron. We're staying at the Two Seasons Hotel. Just waiting for some lunch to be served. We come out here for a quick vape. Um, this place does not allow you to smoke nor vape on the terraces, which is a bit unfair in my opinion. We are on the terrace and I can't see the difference between being out here where there's people and vaping in private on your own terrace. So anyway, just try and give you a bit of a better shot here where we are. And we'll just walk back here. So this is the really nice pool here. We've got this nice waterfall here. Waterfall feature it falls into the pool. Beautiful infinity pool. See, so got a couple of sun lounges here, and a few more over there. These are those rooms I was talking to you about. These are the, uh, rooms. They start from there and go all the way across there. This one on this level actually has its own roof deck. Not roof deck, just its own open deck. The other two on top, they don't. But they have these massive windows and they're like auto control. These ones here, they're the bathrooms I believe. They're like really nice and really expensive. There you have it. Most of the island hopping occurs over there. Around the other side you can go up there. And I showed you yesterday. Coron Town is over there. That's where you go. That's where you go to get the uh, the boat tours. Zoom in a little bit. Yeah, that's sort of like the the, the port where you, where you get all your um, Island hopping boats. I believe there's a market there, those little buildings you see, you can go and get fresh food. It was sunny earlier, but because we had such a hectic day yesterday, we slept in. We slept in till about 10 o'clock, so we didn't have breakfast, didn't have nothing. So we're hungry now. Uh, that's the port just over there. That's where we'll where we will be going to get our fast ferry and that over to El Nido. So um, yeah, there you have it. We're just sitting here. There's these are the two boats. I asked as if they had these private tours from this from this place, but apparently these speed boats only take you to the actual two seasons island resort, which is a bit of a shame. I was hoping we could take a tour on one of these speedboats. Okay, so we've just come back from the doctors, got our medicine, now we, no, our prescriptions, we're trying to find a place to get the medicine. So we've come to this final place here, we'll see if we can get it here or not. So, stay tuned. Yeah. Okay, success after three pharmacies. We finally got what we needed, so let's go for a bit of a walk around town. How much was it? Four. Oh. Let me look. <laughs> 881 peso for some eardrops, some uh, painkillers, and the wife's got two different types of uh, anti inflammatory and some uh, antibiotics. So let's go for a walk around town. Okay, so we've come down to this other side of this building. This is where we stayed a few years ago at the Coron Gateway Hotel. We're up in that room there on the corner, not on the top, but the one just above Steve's. And that's why we came back to Koron, because we were looking forward to having Steve's world famous banana crepes. I believe they were just sensational, best banana crepes I've ever had in the Philippines. Um, 
bit of a shame to see. I've asked the security guy down there where my wife is, and he said uh, Steve's closed a couple of years ago. So, yeah, disappointed. But this is this is where you get picked up for your or you dropped off for your uh, island hopping tours, just over there on that side of where the uh, water's edge is. That's where all the boats come in in the morning, and I will take you across to there, all the way over there. That's where all the all the lagoons are, Kayangan Lake. So they'll take you from here. Sometimes they might drop you off over the other side back there but yeah this is the actual pickup place and drop off for your island tours now, nothing much has changed here I did have a motocross track built in the middle of this a few years ago but now it looks like it's been cleaned up these tents are just empty I think they're set up for like night night stalls or something but yeah you do have sort of some markets just over there around the back and if you go down in between between these buildings there you'll find like markets fresh food seafood and things like that so <coughs> yeah. it's so unfortunate that Steve's is closed unbelievable okay so we're feeling a bit thirsty we're gonna go to our favorite place that makes we believe the best mango shakes in Koron, well they did last time we were here so we'll go and check them again out we'll go and check them out again and see what that's like it's a nice rays coming through the clouds up there I don't know if you can see that wow. looks nice doesn't it Alright, let's go check these mango shakes out. Also, if, you, if you've heard of the Tao Expeditions and you're wondering where they are, that's the main road there and it sort of branches off. This, this bit comes down to the Tourist Information Centre where we've walked from and the Tao Expedition Lobby is just there on the left. So this is the tea and shake place. They make some really nice juices here. So you can get your American breakfast here. Waffles, Americano, sandwiches, cakes. Really nice. So we're going to go in and get ourselves one of these shakes. Okay, so we've just come inside, we're going to have our shakes inside. That air conditioner is blowing really nice. You're doing wonders to the back of my head. So we're inside this um, tea and shake place. These are some of their prices. cheapest I've seen and not the most expensive I've seen. Reasonable prices. Okay so here are the mangoes and they are just as I described before. They are absolutely delicious. Agree? Agree. Most of the mangoes you get or the mango shakes you, you might get while traveling the Philippines. I think they're mixed with some sort of condensed milk. Um, some places you can just uh, blend up the mango itself and depending on how sweet they are it determines how sweet the final product is. And these are I've only got one hand so there's one. There's the other one. So they're a double thumbs up. These are beautiful, nice and cold. I recommend this place if you're in Koron. Tea and shake. Sat up. I 
also, I forgot to mention, if you like your coffee, these guys make really good coffees. From espressos to cappuccinos, to macchiatos, they do it, they make it, and they're really nice. So, a coffee or a mango shake, come here. Alright, we've done enough walking, time to go back to the hotel. Let's roll! seasons following couple of days we've already booked the safari tour which is tomorrow and we're going to do the wreck and reef tour and I think we're going to go for a bit of a helicopter flight over the next couple of days so stay tuned okay so we've organized those tours the safari tour starts at 5 in the morning so we need to go and organize a breakfast pack which we're going to go and do right now from the restaurant here, we just have to go in and speak to them, and they'll give us a menu to check out what we can what we, what we can choose, and um, they'll get that ready for us for the morning. So let's go and do that right now. Hello. Uh, we're doing the safari tour tomorrow. Oh, you went to ask for pack. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Uh, well, we're told we need to be here at 5 a.m. in the morning. Oh, 5 a.m. So in 5 a.m. sir, we can only offer you sandwiches like grilled ham and cheese, grilled cheese, and the BLT. Yeah. Okay. So what do you want then? Uh, BLT. The BLT okay, for you, ma'am. You want? So two of that, two. And also we have some coffee juices or what do you want? So two coffees. Three coffees. Okay. Two, two times the coffee and two times the beer. Also, can you write down your name here and your signature? And your room number? 208. Okay. So expect the pack breakfast at the front desk. At the front desk? Lovely. Thank you. Alright, so that's organised. Our breakfast pack will be made up for us and delivered to the front desk for us before we leave in the morning so all good all done let's go upstairs now and relax okay we're back one thing I'm not a big fan of is when you leave these rooms you pull a key out of the wall and it turns everything off so if you're out for the whole day and you come back to your room you pop your little key in the wall. The room does get a little bit muggy, a little bit humid. So they've had some room service, they've come in, they've cleaned up a little bit, but they have left the half-eaten donut. Maybe they thought we're not we're, we're gonna have it later. But anyway, alright we're back now. Let's 
Let's just relax, kick up our feet, maybe go out to the deck and enjoy the views. Alright, let's do that. Alright guys, I don't know if you can hear us here, but we're just kicking back, laying down on these nice lounges on our roof deck. I don't know if you can see back, there's my hand. That's our room just there. That one there, that's our room. So we've got this whole deck to ourselves. There's no one here. We just met this lovely Canadian Filipino couple. Got this light right here in my face. It's quite bright, but hopefully it's showing up alright. As I've said in the past, this uh, Sony RX100 Mark VI does not do well in low light. But we've got some nice light in front of us here, so hopefully this should be nice and clear for you guys. There's not a cloud to be seen above us. The stars are out, the moon's just up there. Getting a bit thirsty. Getting a bit hungry. <coughs> I, think we don't, I think we need to go and get something to eat, so let's do that and I'll catch on the other side. Actually, I think I might go and get myself a beer right now before we go for dinner. I'm thirsty. There's a camel. You want something to drink? No. No? Alright. I'll show you where our room is. It's just over there. Go and grab a beer. San Miguel Light. Nice and cold. Oh yeah. Cheers guys. <sighs> that hit the spot. But this magnificent view here. We are here till the 19th and hopefully we can stay in this same room without having to move. Wait, remind you, where did this afternoon I think you see? I don't know. I'll have a talk with her and again. see if I can. What was that noise? Oh, that was just, I think, one of the boards creaking here. The chair. That's the chair. Wife's all, the boards always creak when the wife's around. <laughs> Anyway, okay, sorry about that. The old battery ran dead once again. Thank you, Sony, for such a crappy battery. Be lucky to get like an hour recording out of this battery, but thankfully, I've got this backup battery. I don't know if you can see this attached. It's like a, it's like a little mini power bank. It's about, I think, 3,000, 3,800 milliampa. And the battery in the Sony is like a 1,200, so. With this battery I get almost three hours recording, so... Anyway... Bit of a tip, if you come into the Philippines and you know what a... What do you call it? Uh, a cooler is, or a beer or a bottle cooler, make sure you bring one, because these cans, as soon as you crack them, within five minutes they're warm. Unless you can scull these cans in the first hit or two, they're going to be warm. So this one's almost just starting to warm up now. Done. Two sips and it's done. That's quenched my thirst. Now I think, it, I think it's time we need to go and get something to eat. It is warm here. There seems to be little creepies crawling over the back of my neck. Um, so yeah, let's go and get something to eat. I'm starving. Okay guys, uh, we're just going to go and have some dinner. But before we go to dinner, it's... DJI time. Yeah, that's right guys. I'm going to get the bird up. See what sort of footage we can get here. 
at 7.30 at the two seasons. So I'm going to go quickly, go for a quick spin. There's a nice ship just up the road here, probably about 200, 300 metres up. I'm going to go and give that a bit of a flyby and um, bring it back. And then we're going to go for dinner. Okay, so that was the aerial shot of that ship that's just out here. Big ship, it's a big ferry ship. So I hope you enjoyed that footage from above. Now I'm back on deck. Literally, this is the lower deck at the Two Seasons Hotel here in Coron. There's that beautiful pool again. Hope that looked alright from the drone footage. And there's that restaurant we're about to walk into. So, hoi. Let's go. It's tired. Alright, guys, we're back. We just had a big dinner. I had the Angus ribeye steak. Uh, was it nearly 3,000 peso? And um, yeah, it was worth it. Really nice. Um, we're back here now, I'm exhausted, I just want to go to sleep but we still have to get some things ready, we're going on the Koran Safari Tour tomorrow, so charging up the GoPro, charging up some power banks, not sure if I can take the drone with me, so yeah, don't know if I should the batteries are charged anyway, but I don't know if I can take that, so I might just leave that behind. Getting some clothes ready, some swimming gear, some uh, aqua shoes. Uh, maybe take my flippers, not sure, but anyway. 
If you like what you're seeing, give it a thumbs up. If you want to ask a question or you have something to say, anything. That's right, down there. Leave a comment in the comment section. Uh, yeah, tired, want to get some sleep. I think we've got to get up at 4. I've got to pick up at 5 o'clock. And it's a full day tour. Um, and not much more to say. So thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Peace. Don't let go. Oh, oh, oh.